When you go to meet a physician and he orders the CBC counts, you get a report in which you see something called a WBC. WBC is an abbreviation form of white blood cell count. It is white blood cells are your defense systems of your body. When you have infection, the white blood cells, different types, uh, go and fight those infections. You have an injury, the WBC or white blood cells fight those injury. So white blood cells are a marker of inflammation, which could be because of infection or because of injury. If your WBC count is found to be high and you have fever, it could directly mean that you have been carrying some infection. For example, if you have mild viral infection, the WBC count may or may not go up. But if you have a bad bacterial infection, suppose a very bad appendix infection, your WBC count generally will be on the higher side. So WBC counts basically mean you have some infection in your body. It doesn't tell what infection is it, but we can have a possible guess with the level that we see. Higher level indicates bacterial and lower level indicates a possible viral infection. Sometimes WBC counts too high, indicate possibility of blood cancers. Unexplained WBC counts half high, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000 could indicate a possible blood cancer. A normal WBC count, which actually lies between the range of 4,000 to 1,000 is quite variable. And if you do a blood test of WBC on two consecutive or three consecutive days, you may see a difference of even 1,000 to 1,500 in two days. If you run fast and do a WBC count, you may see higher WBC count. So don't get panicked if two consecutive days your blood counts or WBC counts show different results as long as they're in the normal range. Thank you.